Hi! Today we're going to learn about finding the distance between points on the x, y, and z coordinate plane. Let's say we have a problem like this. Find the distance between the points P, which is 5, 6, 7, and the point Q, which is 3, 7, 12. So before we actually dive into the problem, let's figure out how to solve it. So here we have a regular x and y plane, so not with the z. So with an x, y, z coordinate plane, this would be the flat part. So here we just want to find the distance between the two points. And we do that using the distance formula. But what the distance formula really is, is just a Pythagorean theorem. So we find these two lengths, and we can find that easily. And then we find the hypotenuse using the Pythagorean theorem. So that's how we find the lateral distance between the points. Now if we put it on perspective with the z plane, or the z coordinate adding in, let's just draw it here. Let's say one of the points is up here, and the other point is down here. Now in our problem, we can find the height by just subtracting 7 from 12 to get 5. So we know this distance here, and the dark ones are the, or the completely filled lines are the ones that we do know. So we know this distance here. And then we've just found the distance, the lateral distance here, between the two points. So we know this distance here. So this isn't actually going to be like this flat. It could be like these, where the two points are diagonal, like right here. But what we want to find now is the distance between the two points. So now that we've found the distance on the x and y plane between the two points, and we know the height, using that, we can find the, dis the actual distance between the two points on the x, y, and z coordinate plane. How do we do that? Well, once again, the Pythagorean theorem. So let's go through and do this problem. If we know this is a, we know this is b, then we know that this one is equal to the square root of a squared plus b squared. Now we know that that would also become, that would also be the distance here, a squared plus b squared. And then let's say that the height is c. So let's say that the height is c. So that means that this total distance, the actual distance, is equal to, and let's say this is, or we just want to find the total distance, or the actual distance, which is c squared, or the square root, the square root of c squared plus the square root, and this is still under here, under this radical, plus the square root of a squared plus b squared squared. Wow, that's a lot. So what is this simplified to? Well, the square root of a squared plus b squared squared just becomes a squared plus b squared. So this becomes the square root of c squared plus a squared plus b squared. So in reality, finding this distance isn't really that hard. It's actually pretty simple. So now let's do that in our problem. So take a moment to go over this because now I have to erase it. Or actually, we don't. So let's first find the distances between all the points. So let's just live, say, A, B, and C. Now it doesn't really matter which one is the height with the length of the distance between the points because we're going to square all of them and add all of them get together and then take the square root of that. So let's find A. So let's subtract these values from these values and their respective values. So we get 3 minus 5 is equal to negative 2. 7 minus 6 is equal to 1. And 12 minus 7 is equal to 5. That means that a squared is equal to 4, b squared is equal to 1, and c squared is equal to 25. So what does this become, or c squared? So now we have to add them all together. So this part here, 
becomes 4 plus 1 is 5, plus 25 is 30. So, that means that the answer to this problem is just the square root of 30, which you can pl plug into your calculator and solve for. So the answer to this problem is, I'm going to write it up here, the square root of 30 units. And we want the distance, so we're just saying units. So, that's how we solve these problems. If you have to find a distance between points in the x, y, and z coordinate plane, you just take the square root of all the distances, so the height, width, and length. So you just take the square root of all of those squared and add it together. <laughs> Let me rephrase that. So you take the square root of the height squared plus the length squared plus the width squared. And that's how you get the answer. And this is how we came up with that. Today we learned about the distance between points in the x, y, and z coordinate plane. Thank you for watching this video.